friends. Hello, fa. Welcome to American Samoa. Now on this video, this journey, we're going to talk about Pongo Pongo Bay. Except we're not going to be the ones doing the talking. Nope. We're going to have the locals do the talk story. You have got to make it a point to visit beautiful Pongo Pongo Bay. Off to the east, you have Rainmaker Mountain. Off to the west and surrounding the whole place, you have your government buildings, you have shopping, restaurants, everything you'd want. And of course, right here, you have the gorgeous aqua blue warm water. So our harbor right here, the entrance, the entrance right there, you see it coming in. When you're outside, passing, passing through, you can't see, in, you can't see inward. And that's why the military chose this deep harbor, you know, so they could hide back in the day when, you know, German warships would pass by and, you know, it's, it's actually pretty cool when you're out there looking in, you can't see this entrance, you know. It's one of those, you know, really cool things about our island, you know. You have this hidden harbor. from the governor's house all the way up to that mountain up there and one flag day um, uh, an air, a airplane crashed into it they were trying to do a, some type of a show where guys were uh, jumping out the plane with parachutes and stuff and they got caught on the cable and a, I think it crashed here it crashed into the hotel the, the plane man it was crazy I, mean, they, I think they still have footage of it and pictures on uh, online if you go look for it, you know, they'll show you. Behind me over here, we have the gorgeous Rainmaker Mountain, the root of all of our weather. Rainmaker Mountain, it, it, the reason why they call it Rainmaker Mountain is every time, always over there, that, that mountain over there starts to raining every time. And that's why they call Rainmaker Hotel. That's, that's where the rain starts, like most of the time. So that's exactly where I'm from, from that village of Oua. We're right under beneath that mountain. So we always shower, like with rain, like most of the time. Yeah. That's why they call it Rainmaker uh, Mountain. So before, it used to be a Rainmaker Hotel right over here. The reason why they name it Rainmaker Hotel is because it's facing the Rainmaker Mountain before. But now there's no there's no more ho uh, Rainmaker Hotel. Now it's Sadie's by the sea. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, brother. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs>
telling you to open the kuru so you can see uh, how much kuru you need. So, I mean, yeah, style. 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 It's a special kind of recipe. All right, can you give us the recipe? Well, they own this. <laughs> Oh, the chef is right here. He's the one that owns the recipe. Oh, he owns the recipe. Chef owns the recipe. Wait, you want to know the marinade for this barbecue? Barbecue sauce with ketchup, brown sugar. Yeah, you use soy sauce. And onions, and garlic. It's a special one for the It's pretty much it. Some lemon and some oranges. And two beers. Two beers? Yeah. Oh, wow, okay. I didn't stop. <laughs> Umea village. This is a nice beach right now. Uh, when we closed, yeah, this is our village over there right now. Yeah, the St. James Square, you know? Sick. That is a love in American Samoa. It's football. It's their favorite game. In Samoa on Sundays you'll find pretty much everybody in church most of your businesses are closed it's a very respected day there are some stores that will be open and some small restaurants here and there but it's a very reserved island so Sunday not much but relaxation goes on there are churches in just about every denomination so you'll be able to find some place to go if you go to church. On this trip, we stayed at Sadie's by the Sea, right here Pongo Pongo Bay. We got Rainmaker Mountain just right over there. They have the Goat Island Cafe right here on the property with a beautiful pool. And it's close to everything. They're shopping, it's on the bus line. Great attractions. Now keep in mind there is another Sadie's. There's a Sadie Thompson Inn just right up the road. But this is the one that is on the beach. Great place to stay. from our room at a fraction of the cost of a room in Hawaii.
onions. You're good, thank you. <laughs> We are here at the Goat Island Cafe enjoying another delicious meal. I've got the crispy fish wrap. Oh, that is so good. I'm having the poke Samoan style. And basically the difference between Hawaiian poke and Samoan poke is they put coconut milk into it. Plus we have bananas with it. And we're so enjoying it though. having locals on our channel thank you thank you everybody thank you so much for spending your time with us if you liked what you saw please hit that bell for notification of future videos and we'd also greatly appreciate it if you subscribe and join our family thank you thank you